Developing tonight, terror for parents and loved ones in a small community in Iowa. Police say a teenage shooter killed at least one person this morning. All of this was just before classes started at Perry Middle and High School following the holiday break. Kevin Dorn joins us live from the newsroom with the new details on it, Kevin. Now guys, the suspected shooter has been identified as 17-year-old Dylan Butler, a student at the school. Police found him dead from a self-inflicted gunshot wound when they arrived at the school. It all began just after 7.30 this morning. Perry is a small town about 45 minutes northwest of Des Moines. Police say a sixth grade student was shot to death. They also found an explosive device in the school, which they disarmed. Five others were wounded. Those include four students and a school administrator. One woman told reporters her stepson was hit in the back and arm, but is going to be okay. Her daughter texted her about the shooting. It was a text message this morning from my daughter, and it was absolutely horrifying. Like, the pain in your heart is just overwhelming. That's one of the worst moments of my entire life, but the best phone call I got was saying that they were okay. According to police, Dylan Butler had a pump shotgun and a small caliber handgun on him when they found him dead. As for a motive, police say Butler made a number of social media posts in and around the time of the shooting, and they're searching his accounts looking for evidence. The shooting happened before the school day started, and there were very few students and faculty inside the building. The Perry School District will be closed Friday as this investigation continues. In the newsroom, Kevin Dorn, 5 Eyewitness News. Kevin, thank you so much.